Hey free gang, how's it going? We are coming to you live, but not live, from London. We're back in our home. I don't know if we weren't back in our home last time. Yes, we were, but we finished up back in our home. I lose track of the day sometimes. Just want to say a big thanks to some of you guys who over the previous weekend come and saw us at the Kent Vegan Festival. Some of you come and saw my talks. Some of you come and hung out with us and chat with us. It was really, really nice. Always love connecting with some of you guys. But today we've been having a really, really nice morning so far. We've got a lot of things to run around and do this morning. And in a short amount of time, we've got to pop out to get some uh, things at B&Q. And Jody wants to get some clay there, I think, is where we said. I've got to go and get a new laptop. Also, we've got our friend Av coming around. You may remember Av from previous videos, some of the videos in Crete as well, from Mind Body Boxing. He's coming around, we're going to work on some things together, and he's coming around this morning. We've got to get all our things done before he gets here, otherwise he'll be like, where are these guys? Meanwhile, Katie and Jojo are in the bedroom, they're just doing some learning together. Jamie is out of a boyfriend, I think, and Sam is at work. So yeah, just your average day, we're all buzzing around doing our own things, but I'm very, very thirsty, and the only way to start a thirsty morning day is... Juicing. We've got plenty of oranges here ready to be used. We've got a couple of grapefruits amongst here as well somewhere. And Katie's mangoes have got their own little spots over here. One of them's taking a jump out of the box. Naughty mango. Katie won't be happy with you if you start running away like that. Come to think of it though, I don't know if I've actually got any time for juicing right now. I might have to do it when we get back. So, uh, no juicing. And we're out in the car. We're out in a rush. And Mummy's here. Hello, Mummy. Hello, Daddy. I mean, I like free game. <laughs> you say hello to me too. You don't have to just do it for them. And how are you doing, Jojo? Uh, I am doing late. You got your iPad just to keep you company while we're driving around doing all these things. And you're hiding behind the iPad. Oh. And he's disappeared. It's literally been 100 miles an hour this morning where it, it, you don't have time to even pick up a camera to say. Not literally 100 miles an hour. Ah, it isn't literally 100 miles an hour. Well, I don't know. I've been pretty fast. Not 100 miles an well, hour. Well, you didn't have a speedometer to tell me differently. How can you prove it? I've got one in my brain. So where are we going first? We're going to B&Q first. You know what paint we need, yeah? You took a picture of it. I haven't got it on my phone anymore. Anymore. Are you kidding me? It's on my hard drive. I saved the picture, but... Oh, well. Let's keep this on camera. Uh, do, can you remember what it was called? Like a hint of grey or something like that, wasn't it? If I see it, I'll remember it. Yeah. I know that. Paint problems, eh? I know the brand. <laughs> I know the brand. Russell Brand. I know Russell that, Brand. That, that, yeah, that, we've met that, Russell that, Brand. That. A few times. He's a nice guy. How do we go from where we're going for the paint to we've met Russell Brand? So what we bring you guys, tangents. Tangents that will make you possibly lose your mind. I don't like the lighting in this car right now. I've just got this glow of sun here. You're in the dark. Talk about yin and yang. Get out of it, you. Okay, much better lighting now, mummy. Don't we look normal and stuff? No, so, we'll, we'll never look normal. So we're just at PC World. Look at that. She loves this stuff. Yeah, I'm getting a new laptop because, quite frankly, I need a new one. I've not been able to put out vlogs sometimes because I've run out of space on my current laptop and it means a lot of work around so I need one with more memory a bigger screen as well to do certain things and my good friend Av I wanted to help him out so we're passing down this laptop I feel like I'm passing down a baby I'm pa passing down my old laptop to him once I've got this one so there's nothing wrong with the old laptop no though. it's well efficient it's just it doesn't meet my ridiculous demands for YouTube and work and everything else creativity anyway let's go into Pook World let's go let's go in this way <laughs> There's a gold in there. Should have bought the football. Oh. <laughs> we didn't come here for drones. Uh, no, but look at it, man. It's just epic. I got caught by this. Just good to look at. Yeah. Just good to look at. Yeah. Oh man, oh wow, well, that's a phantom one, I can use that with um... You can't use it with anything, go okay. and get your phone. Oh, that'll be the drone size for me. Oh, little baby drone, oh, little baby drone, please. Go and find your laptop. What's that? Pokemon. Pokemon? I'm Pokemon, I'll poke you on. Oh no. Man. I can teleport by the way. Wow, I didn't know you could teleport. <laughs> What are you doing down there? Where are you going? A laptop. You sit down at a desk and everything. <laughs> you sit down at a desk to buy a laptop now. You might have to switch your laptop. It's not working as always. Oh. Need to buy you guys a computer. How would you rate your service today? Mm -hmm. 10 out of 10? Uh, probably. I, I like how you <laughs> to the guy there, like. Is he giving you a funny look, was he? Oh, go! Let's just go. Do you know what, that was a lot smoother than I planned. Normally I fuss about quite a bit with these things, don't I? I that was some efficient laptop buying. I know, I just went you. 
Okay, that one okay. now. Next up, B and Q. Hello. Oh, there's a little doggy. Hello. Oh, how much space in there? What are we getting here again, Mummy? Something to do with Russell Brand. Paint. Russell Brand's painting. Shut up. We're getting paint. <laughs> paint, and he wants to get some sort of clay or something. Well, I might have to find like a hobby and craft because I thought this is like a DIY place, and you're not going to get clay in a DIY place. <laughs> Comment below. Where'd you get clay from? Yeah, it's no, it's no help now, is it? Why are you commenting so well, late? We can go and dig our own out of the ground or something. Yeah. Stairs and lift race, people. Stairs and lift race. Let's go, Jojo. Come on. Not below the stairs. Not below the stairs. Not below the stairs. Come on. Come on. I'm not waiting for you. I think we did it. We beat her. Let's see her face when she comes out showing that she's lost. Jojo, should we get in the hot tub? Should we get one and put it in the front room? Yeah. We're not going to. Yeah, I'm not going to. <laughs> what the? What are you two doing in there? Wait, on you. You're going to get told off. How much is it? Five, nine, nine, five. Oh, Do really? it for less. Do it for less. Okay, then. About five. <laughs> I know. I know. What about one penny? What about one penny? One penny. penny. That, like yeah, that sounds good. Who is being q stand? Is it like, like partners' names like Benson and Quentin? I don't know. I don't know what it stands for. Or is it anything to do with the I know what being q stands for. What? Bum quads. Bum quads. No. Yeah, comment below. What are your funny combinations of what it could be? Let's keep it clean. Let's keep it nice. Oh, I want it funny. Bum quads is apparently what's to beat at the moment. Bum and quads. Sounds like an exercise. <laughs> Yo, no. <laughs> you come in. <laughs> Yo, no. <laughs> oh, can we get out of here? This place is drilling, man. Oh. The only problem is I'm feeling a little sore. I've got a sinking feeling we're in the wrong area. Oh, man, it's well lit in here. You gonna get any of those, babe? No, I've gone off the rails. I'm just thinking if the car's not working and we can't get ourselves home, maybe we should be cabbing it. I finally get the picture. Ah, screwed up again. This is intense. Let's not rule out getting this. My high pressure washer. Ah, <laughs> oh, my biggest fan. Daddy, I've got a sore head. Katie? Yes? Have I ever told you how much I adore you? I'm feeling safe now. Yes, I've nailed it. Finally, we found some paint. So, Jojo, do you, would you like to tell everyone why we need paint? Because the walls are dirty. Why are the walls dirty? Because <laughs> you keep doing handstands up them, don't you? No. Never mind. Found it. I knew I'd remember it. Great hints. Yeah. Okay, cool. Get some then. You two do the travelator, I do the stairs. Okay, go. Daddy's racing us. He's going down the stairs. Hurry up. Right, guys, can we just be normal, please? So we were in and out of there quite efficiently, Mummy. Quicker than I thought we would be. We could have been quicker, though. Oh, what, being cute? We just can't help the silliness, can we? Well, that was some good time news. I wouldn't change anything, to be honest. I'd love to hear if you've got any tool or DIY related puns. Leave them in the comments below. This is going to be some silly comments section. We'd love to hear your ideas. These are very important to us. We're very excited to see what your creations are. Don't let us down for a game. You haven't in the past. Keep it up. They didn't let us down with the jokes. The jokes one was great. I love it. You give these guys a chance to like engage in the silliness and they take the opportunity. I like him. I like your attitude. When You're we good. said to comment below your joke, wow, they was they were I was actually proper laughing out loud at those jokes. So we're on the way home now, but something we wanted to talk to you guys about something that's going to be happening very soon you're going to see in an upcoming vlog it's something that has been talked about for a very long time and it's something which it's been talked about more than anything else on this channel yeah and it's jojo's hair jojo has decided that he wants to get his hair cut yeah mm. haven't you mate yeah. maybe it's because it's very very long now i think it's because it's summer and maybe it's you're getting a bit hot with it so he we talked about it the other day and also it's getting quite in my eye yeah. Also getting quite in my eyes. <laughs> I like how you have big bold eyes as you say that. 
Bung. Bung. Yeah, so because it's so talked about on this channel, we thought we might as well share it with you lot as well. This is something we've talked about with him for a long time, and you know, we love his hair, how it is, but at the same time, we just want him to be happy. We've spoken to a nice lady at a really amazing hair salon in London. She's willing to take on the job. So comment below if you want us to film that and show you a before and after. We did it before when he got cornrows, didn't we? You guys seem to really like that. If you haven't seen that video when he did get those cornrows, you can check out the video up in the corner there. But yeah, so that's quite exciting. It's making me feel quite nervous because I'm like, we're so used to the way he looks now. His hair is just like a part of him. He's always like his character, it. Yeah. yeah, like he's doing cartwheels and his hair's going all over the place. And so yeah, I think it might be quite a, a shift for us. But you know, it's not about us. It's about what Jojo wants and he's expressed that he wants it. He said, I don't want to get involved in any of the decisions about it. We were trying to ask him, where do you want to have it done and stuff like that. And he's like, I just want it cut. You lot sort it out. I just want to get it cut. And I was like, okay. <laughs> So yeah, it's not about us, it's about him. Yeah, and, and he knows how he wants it as well, doesn't he? Yeah, he sort of knows how he wants it, yeah. So we've sent some pictures over to the lady at the salon, so see what happens. We do actually have another update to give you, something which you guys have been asking us about for quite a while, so we'll be happy to give you that. We probably won't give you it just yet though. Can't bombard them with updates. Y yeah. <laughs> Too many updates, update yeah. overload. I hope you don't forget to tell them now. I know. said that. <laughs> We're just heading home now though. We are going to be meeting our friend Av. He will probably be there soon, so I might have to call him actually to see where he is. Could be waiting somewhere lonely. So off out now. Got back five minutes and then back out again. Just going to go and meet Av. Get off your phone, mate. Come on. <laughs> Oh, you you want some of this, do you? You want some? Do you want <laughs> some, do you? Do you want some, do you? <laughs> what are you doing? YouTube club. <laughs> Look at the mess you've made. Yeah, I boxed out the new Mac. It's good having this next to it though because I looked it in the shop and I was like, it's not any bigger. But it is. So Av here is getting this lovely Mac being passed down. He's starting up his YouTube channel. We're in early stages. What you guys can do, I'll put a link in the description. Go and send the guy some love. He's going to be putting out some proper, proper good energy. So go and give him. Let's get him up to at least 100 subscribers. Whoa. And then he's going to be banging out some serious content. Please. And I'll tell you what, not only is it going to be stuff that teaches and it's going to be entertaining, there's probably going to be a lot of silliness in there because this guy can't help himself. Mm, I'm just like this guy. If you're into him, you're probably going to be into me. A few moments later. What's going on here? Oh, uh, um, YouTube, you, YouTube. Learning about Minecraft. And also we have the gas. The yeah, gas, look. And that, that, that's what we click to bring people to the YouTube link. Yep. Yeah. Nice save, Ab. <laughs> <laughs> Lads on top, 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 lads on Oh, you can do those, can you? <laughs> Naughty boy. What's going on, Jojo? Just doing some feet. You can see, but no one else can. So the free gang oh, can have a little peeky, cheeky look. What's going on? Maybe they should wait for the grand reveal with everyone else. It's unfair. <laughs> We're basically doing that game where you do a body part and you fold over the piece of paper just to make some weird amalgamation of body parts, which is supposed to resemble some sort of living being. Great game, actually. Mm. Well, this one Jojo wasn't happy with because he wanted to do the body. This uh, muscle cat with stripy clown trousers. I enjoyed quite a lot. This one was crazy. This robot. I don't even know what this is. And this one, I know it's sad. <laughs> and this one is uh, saying hello and has 222 on there, which is awesome. Are we ready for the grand reveal, Jojo? Yeah. Grand reveal time! My goodness, Whoa. what on earth has happened there? Two out of ten. Two out of ten? Because he just looks really weird. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. How casual he is. Or she is. 
Well, they are. I'd say it's a sheep. We've actually brought this game up before a few times and some of you guys said they've played it. But how many of you have started playing it since we've mentioned it? Have you been felt inspired? We've always said we want to inspire people on this channel and <laughs> if we inspire you to play this then we'll, we'll take that. But let us know in the comments below how many of you have been inspired to play this game. And um, try and describe what sort of creations you have made if that is possible. Which I doubt it is. For today, this sign will be ignored. Whoa. So we're just popping out to a little garden over the back. Just have a kick about because that's how we let go. So Jojo Joe's trying to make a match and so far we've got for a goal a stick and a piece of bread those are our goal posts the manager doesn't look satisfied with this oh i'm not oh wait wait wait, wait. i found another piece of bread there's another piece of bread over there as well oh man we're done game on go tackle him go tackle him <laughs> The game has now progressed from football to it with a ball. <laughs> Once again, number three now, I think. Kirby, this is what we've been waiting for all day. Hey! First time! Yeah. Way! So all the fun and games are over, we've come in and we're making some food. What have we got going on here, mummy? Some chips? It's the most simple meal going. Chips and lentils. Jojo wants beans, so Jojo's going to have beans. Thank you, mummy. Thank you. I, I like simple meals like this. Yes. No complicated. Mm -hmm. You've got lots of what you need. The bread is amazing. It, it's a very um, beige meal, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Colour doesn't matter. It doesn't always have to be a rainbow. So today has been a million miles per hour. All of that playing around, coming back, working on YouTube, working with Av, and time's got away of us. We had a nice dinner and everything, but uh, I've got to drop Av to the station now. Where did that time? I don't know. Go? I know, we've been busy bunnies, haven't we? Mm. Bouncing around, eating carrots. Yeah, we haven't like vlogged properly today. No, it's been in bits and bobs, hasn't it? Because yeah. then, we, then we'd have like two hours when we're working on the laptop and all of us together and working on things. And then we'd be like, oh, dinner. But that's life though. Sometimes it's good to feel engaged and actually present in what you're doing. And then other times so it's great to be able to share it with you guys as well. Anyway, I've got to go and take you out to the station and I've got something interesting to tell you guys. Yeah, it's a very important update when Bob gets back. Just bear with me. I'll only be like five, 10 minutes. Okay. Layers, man. Well, take care of yourself. Safe journey. Bye-bye. Layers. Bye -bye. Well, that was quite quick, wasn't it? Well, it didn't feel like five after 10 minutes for you guys, did it? That's the power of YouTube. And now are you, mummy, you okay? Yep. Yeah. Should we show the free gang what Jojo looks like right now? <laughs> <laughs> what he looks like, bless him. He looks like a rock star at the end of a party. Yeah, he just went to sleep while we were tidying everything up. But yeah, he's had a long busy day, hasn't he? He's been yeah. very excited. The only trouble is when Jojo goes to sleep, not in his own bed. We have to somehow lift him and he's heavy. Yeah, it's no easy task moving him. Yeah, let's put a blanket over him for a minute. Just to keep him cozy. There we go. There we go. Right, we'll turn the light off and we'll leave him for a little while. Yeah, and we'll move him in a bit because he's only just dropped off. So, update part two. And many of you have been asking about Catsmere, the cat that has been living with us for a lot of the time since you've been on this channel. For those of you that are new to the channel though, our neighbour's cat really took a liking to us, started coming into our house. We don't eat meat, so we had no food to give her. I don't know why, she just really liked us. <laughs> Can you blame and her? then uh, she had, she ended up having kittens here. So yeah, we had some lots of big dilemmas. Predicament central. Pre yeah, there was just, it was like an ongoing thing. We didn't know what to do with the kittens. Mm. The lady came and took them, but then the cat wasn't feeding them properly. So the kittens had to come back. Then she offered to let us have the kittens, but then we had to decline because we're not, you know, we're not here enough. We had to look after the kittens. It was an ongoing saga, It was an ongoing thing. And um, the last 
last I think these guys heard was that the kittens had gone back, wasn't yeah, it? They, yeah, they'd gone back. The lady took them. They were they were old enough, so they went back. But everyone's been asking, oh, how are the kittens? Yeah. So, yeah, so you went and spoke to the lady, didn't you? Yeah, and uh, she told me that the kittens have all moved on to different homes, to loving families. For those of you who remember, there was one stripy and quite fluffy looking kitten that's gone to one family, and the other two kittens have gone together to another family. So for those of you that were asking and were wondering how they've been, have they gone to loving homes? They've all gone to loving homes, they're all happy, and yeah, it's, it's worked out for the best in the yeah. end for all animals, humans, and non humans alike. And Kat Samir has started coming back to us as well. Yeah, she was here earlier. <laughs> it's like a social club for her, isn't it? But she's just a really social cat, isn't she? Yeah, the only thing is, she like wakes us up in the night, she goes. <laughs> on the door 1am last night yeah but yeah so that's what's happening we thought we'd give you guys an update thanks for being so patient with us but obviously without her being our cat it's hard to always know exactly yeah. what's going on and I know a lot of you really wanted us to keep the kittens but we had to think about their welfare we really really wanted to keep them but it's not about us it's about them and we're travelling a lot we haven't got a cat flat I just don't know how it would have worked and you need to be in a reliable and responsible position to look after animals and you know considering our commitment of traveling and stuff like that for different things we just can't always be here for them yeah, really. yeah yeah and we know now that they're in places where people are available there's people there during the day so they can take care of them yeah so we're happy if you want any more information just on the stories video up in the corner there was multiple videos of all of these updates of the kittens and everything that's happening but if you want to see what they were like and everything that happened you can check out the video in the corner so thank you so much for watching this video today, guys. We really appreciate it. I hope you've enjoyed it. Let us know in the comments below all of your thoughts, your feelings. We love reading your comments. Before we finish, though, I'm going to do some shout-outs for some of you lovely free gang who have been requesting them. So shout-outs to Bella Kelly, Lily Butcher, Ruby Betts, Besties for Life. Cool name. I know, I thought that too. Hmm. Taylor Ruby, that's on behalf of your friend Lisa Rock. Lisa Rock and Gabby Rock are absolutely killing it when it comes to the shout outs. Mariam Akhtar, Little 7 And this last shout out is a really special one. It's for, it's for two different people, Tessa Brooks and Juice Fan Vlogs. Now this is from Cat Rhodes who commented that she's not gonna ask for a shout out for herself, but rather just pick a shout out for the person above her in the comments and the per person below her in the comments. And Aww. I just think that was such a nice selfless thing. And we're all about it on this channel, about being selfless, about being kind to others. So good on you, Cat Rhodes. Big shout out to you. Big love to you guys. Thank you so much for always watching, always commenting. If any of you guys ever want a shout out, let us know in the comments below. And we'll do it in a future video. I've if got a shout out. Oh. Who's that for? Shout out to Av. Yes, yeah, shout out to Avion. We've enjoyed spending so much time with him today. And you know what, guys? Go and follow that man. Go and follow what he's doing. He deserves your support because he's got so much good to share. And I'm really excited about what he's going to be bringing onto YouTube and hoping to inspire other people as well. And if any of you are new to this channel as well and you, you know, liking our vlogs and following our life, we would love it if you subscribe to our channel. But if you're already subscribed, why don't you hit the notification bell? What the hell it's was that? Down. Yeah, subscribe that way. Yeah, hit the notification bell if you want to stay in the know and kept up to date on when we do upload videos. And we will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out. Bye. Good cushion work.